Captain Ops, we're stuck here. Hey, at least the dumb skies let's keep our weapons. They demonstrate their lack of fear. It was a proven battle tactic. Katathian warriors often ride into battle completely naked. Keep your pants on. Although, it could be used as a distraction. Yeah, no. Any other ideas? Can you froth? I can froth. Can you twitch? Yeah, I'm pretty twitchy. All right. I mic you, you drop, froth, and twitch. While they're all distracted, we take off down one of them side halls. What about me? You, well, you know, you, uh, take one for the team. I'm not gonna... Walk with me. Come on, Quill, just grab your chest and drop. Find another plan. Yo, what's up, guys? Uh, welcome to more cutting So, the matriarch asked for us by name. You, specifically. Although I cannot fathom why. Peter is constantly surprising us, too. But if he's first in line for brainwashing, I gotta say... Is that what you think? That we're brainwashing people? We've met your recent converts. Overly zealous doesn't even begin to describe them. They have embraced the Matriarch's promise. A life-altering experience, yes. But one that must be freely accepted. Quill, his drone. It's her ticket out of here. What? How? What are you two whispering about? Well? He wants to know if you know you're the bad guy. Uh, actually, we were just admiring how huge this place is. It is grand, isn't it? Yep. Belief in the Matriarch restored it to what it was before the war. Just as her promise will restore everyone we lost. Mothers. Lovers. Sons. This promise will raise the dead? Of course it won't. We can't bring people back. We can't. But the matriarch, the divine vessel. I got an idea, but I need time. Stall him. Wow, oh, oh, okay, that, uh, that is a cool trick. Want to explain how you did it? Sorcery. I can understand how some might see it that way, but I used science. The science of faith. Faith is not science. But faith energy is. This skiff. My inquisitiveness. Even... Sacrosanct herself, all powered by the same miraculous energy. Energy I discovered. I'm going for the drone. Keep him talking. But now? What? What is it? It's just, um. You, uh. You, uh, discovered stuff, and you claim to, uh. control energy. Faith energy? Right. Uh, well, it just seems like all this... Uh... I, I think what Gamora's point is, is... Um, you say you have all of this energy. Faith energy. Right, but when we first saw you, weren't you stranded on Hallow's Hope because your shuttle ran out of juice? Yes, I was, but... So why don't you just believe that your ship had more gas? It doesn't work that way. Faith energy is a byproduct of belief. Focused belief. Okay, sure. I saw this proven. Focused belief in him is what enabled us to survive. So, you were saying. Wait. Weren't there more of you? What? No, 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 no. Nope. Oh boy. It seems like the kind of thing that we would be aware of. Indeed. Please continue your fascinating account of. Yeah, you were saying something about him? It seems super important. 
Right, right. Uh, your father. Uncle. Son? My son died of disease. The him I was referring to was someone else. The first divine vessel of this church, before it was even a church. An absurd faith healer, bathed in gold and light, and wielding unfathomable power. He saw my loss, our collective loss, knew its cause, but refused to reverse it. Because he, personally, never felt what we feel. That is why I founded this church. To heal. To give hope to those who have lost everything. <clears throat> Wait, there were more of you. The little one is missing. Perhaps he died like your son. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can't even choose. Okay. <laughs> right? Yes. Good point, Groot. He is totally into his spiritual mission. But I think I figured out all of this. Those were some pretty sweet holograms. <laughs> I think even the world might be jealous. I mean, they must have cost you an arm and a well, another arm. <laughs> right? And this? That's a pretty sweet trip, too. But everybody's got anti gravity Oh, and let me guess. You got your own personal shield generator tucked under that territory, don't you? <laughs> a little makeup, some color coordination. Oh, loving the gold laser light show, by the way. Got a pretty sweet little scan. <laughs> I'm actually impressed. Well, good for you. Hey, I get it, man. You gotta sell the brand before you stage the miracle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Man, this one time on Rigel 3. You uh, think you're all very clever. You hope to delay me because you're afraid. But there is nothing to fear. Why? Get back here where I can see you. Yeah, yeah. It's time to meet the Matrix. We're gonna summon the Milano. My new buddy will show us the way. We're being very cryptic, Rodan. Yeah, well, I get twitchy when I'm surrounded by giant murder bots. They just want us to meet their new mommy. Speaking of which, who else thinks Will's ex-girlfriend traded in her cop badge for cult ropes? Come on. What? I'm just saying what we're all thinking. The Guardians of the Galaxy. Thank you, Grand Unifier. Guardians, we may approach. Peter Quill, order your offspring to come down from there this instant. Maybe I'm out of line, but aren't you a little young for a dress that short? Aren't you a little old to write your name on your clothes? Oof. Uh. Took you long enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, chatty grandpa gets. Hey, we're gonna get you out of here. Just follow my lead. But this is where we're supposed to be. We're gonna save everybody. I'm gonna save them, I promised. Come on, snap out of it, kid. You're just saying what he wants you to say. Oh, hold on, everybody! The girl is clearly not herself. Of course I am. 
I'm more than just me. What do you mean? Where's your mom? Mom is here. She's right here. Inside me. Oh, thanks for clearing that up. The light joined us. I thought she was gone. But I can bring her back. They're all waiting for us to bring them back. All we need is faith. The Grand Unifier helped me understand. This is one big con. Trust me, I know a thing or two about- Why can't you just believe in me? Why won't you just listen? Nobody ever listens. Until I show them. Mom, what, what's going on? How, how is this possible? You saved me. That's how. I knew you would never leave me. I, I, I didn't. I mean... Look at you. Look at you, all grown up. And into the great leader I knew you would become. <laughs> Peter, I am so proud of you. Your father would be so proud. I, I, I don't understand. I... I saw you die. Am I... Did I go back? You are here. That's all that matters. We have all the time in the world now. You and me. And your friends, too. My friends? Sure. The house is plenty big enough. And I want to meet this amazing team of yours and hear all about your incredible adventures. <laughs> <laughs> that is... You don't know how bad I've wanted this. Nothing will ever break us apart, I promise, Peter. I promise. I can't believe I have you back. Uh, Mom? Let go of me. Stop. I can't believe I have you back. Seriously, Mom. I can't believe I have you back. Uh, Mom? Please, let go of me. Uh, what is happening right now? I can't believe I have you back. Mom, you're squeezing kind of tight. We have so much time to make up for. Maybe we'll... I guess that needs replacing. That was a little loose. Shouldn't be the cause of the problem, though. <laughs> Plugs are like new, so that's not something. the problem. Hmm. Might need to top off the oil. Peter! Dinner's almost ready! Yeah, be right there, Mom! Mom! 
Meredith Quill, where do you keep your carving knives? Oh, there's one in the drawer, nearest the stove. All I see is a dull instrument fit for a child. <laughs> That's the one. I will have to bring you a Katathian blade on our next visit. There you are, Peter. I was just about to come out and call you again. Some things never change, I suppose. Ah, Peter Quill. Your mother was just telling us about your childhood. Just some of your better adventures? She also told us she had found a suitable mate for you. But oh. you refused to see reason. Drax, you said that would stay between us. Are you still pushing that Janie thing? She's a lovely girl, Peter, who's turned into an even lovelier young woman. Oh. She does sound pretty nice, Peter. Better than all the rest of them, for sure, Quill. All the rest of them? Your son is rather promiscuous, Meredith Quill. Dude! Not cool! Sounds like we need to have a serious talk over dinner, Peter. Why do I feel like I'm about to get grounded? Mora, what did I say about putting your clothes in the wash with mine? That you'd be happy to take care of it? Oh, I know this. I believe you still have this. The craftsmanship is shoddy at best. Be nice, Drax. Peter tried. Oh, boy. Hey, uh, Quill, can you do something about your mutt? He won't stop staring at me. No, he just wants to play. Maybe you should take him outside and let him chase you around. Har har! <laughs> just about as funny as this game is exciting. You know, we could all go to the Oh, boy. Nah, I'm, I'm, I'm different with rating choice. Jeez. <laughs> that is... You don't know how bad I've wanted this. Oh, nothing will ever break us apart. I promise, Peter. I promise. I can't believe I have you... Let go of me. Stop. I can't believe I have you back. Seriously, Mom. Stop hugging me! Peter! The cold! Of Dude. course it's me, sweetie. Why do you have to shoot your own mom, guys? Uh, come on. Peter! It's okay. You're scared. <laughs> Why won't you believe me? I can't leave me in this place. Oh, man. I really. I have, I have to, no, oh. okay, this is bad. Peter? <sighs> Come on now. <laughs> Fine. Oh. You're being silly. I'm not going to look though, so. This is not real, right. but then... <laughs> That's right, Stevie. You're not her. That's she's... Right, she's Stevie. not... None of this is real. That's right, sweetie. It's all inside my head. <clears throat> my mother died when I was 13. It's okay. You're scared. <sighs> Why won't you believe me? You can't leave me in this place. I can't lose you again. Please. please. <laughs> I'm so sorry for this. Please, I'm so sorry. <laughs> now, Peter, while it's distracted, we can reach Nikki. Dad, hmm. come on, get up. We don't have much time. <clears throat> we need to get everything ready. Mom will be home soon. Come on, get up. Nikki, what? 
Oh, okay, that was kind of hard to do, I would die. Oh. I knew she wasn't real, you know, but then, I, you know. Finally! I need your help. Mom will be home for lunch soon and I want everything to be perfect. Perfect? For her birthday. That's today! Did you forget again? Dad? Eh, I'm admitting. Dad! Uh... Honestly, kinda. Are you kidding? Dad! You promised you'd help me surprise Mom for her birthday. I, I did? Yes! You said you'd help fix the hollow projector, and the cake still needs candles, and I can't find the present we got her. Right. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. Is this looks amazing. Did you make it? No, I... There's a bake? No! I baked it! Okay, that just leaves the present and projector. Hmm. Uh, Nick? Is it supposed to be fuzzy? Uh, obviously not. It's not focused right or something. Can you refocus it? Wow. It turned out so good. I was sure I messed part of it up. Wait, did you make this? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's hollow and the star system around it, and I think I got all the moons. It's beautiful. Just need mom's present now. I think it's somewhere in my room. Oh. Now there's a room this way again. I Good. Oh. Oops. Hey, you still have Chewy? Yeah, he's captain of the Milano now. Really? Well, congrats, I guess. Happy birthday, love, Nikki and Peter. Why don't I remember this? Did you find it? Yeah. Okay, put it with the others. Great, the gift. Put it on the table. Oh. I just said, drop it like that, my guy. This man doesn't want to put it on it. Wait. Which table are you talking about here? Not cool, bro. Oh, nope. Which table am I supposed to put this in? We are still on your mom's ship, right? Of course. You're so weird. Weird doesn't begin to cover it. Galaxy's greatest dad. Is that supposed to be me? Obviously. Is this another illusion? I'm assuming it is. Why can't I put this in the table? Or maybe right here? Probably. Yep. One birthday present. What did you get her? 
We got it. On Nowhere. Remember that artist alley we went to and the painting she really liked? Of Cree Laura? Oh. Right? Yeah. Anything else? I don't think so. How does it look? Amazing. Your mom's gonna love it. Thanks, Dad. I love you. Uh, wow. <laughs> okay, I, uh... Nikki, why is the door locked? Oops. Ma'am, I'll make sure everything's perfect. You get the door. Surprise! Peter? Were you two... No! <clears throat> Don't believe me, Peter. What? This isn't real. She's being tricked. She never should have been here. What she saw... I don't know how, but the three of us are connected now. That thing, that thing has her, but she can still be saved. She has to accept my death. She must. Show her how to let me go. Free my daughter. Save her. Please! Okay. Child! Get the matriarch out of here! Now! By rejecting the promise, you are proving yourselves unworthy. Uh, it's and not the boss fight. Destroyed. Yeah. I'm so good. What is that 
Shoot Peter Quill! Peter Quill! No fair! Go this way! He's boosting I everyone for us! I think the big guy's seeing stars! Get back in there, Tiger! Next round's on me! Vengeance. Barely a flesh wound! You'll be fine! Crash! Destroy! What kind of church has bouncers? I think you need executioners! Get on the fire! He's healed! I see him, Brute! Watch out! That one's been boosted! Holmes is healing his pals! Well, that's not fair! Creep's channeling our fire! Watch your oh. Got 
the church has bouncers! I think you mean executioners! Can't figure out how to hurt this one! Oh. <laughs> Warp drive coolant. We can't just jump in there. We need to keep moving. Maybe I wasn't clear. That's a pool of instant death. <laughs> what? Tracks! Tracks, man. Uh, everything okay? Yes. Okay, so maybe it ain't warp drive coolant. <laughs> That's tingly. Well,. We need to talk about your kid trying to kill us. Raker did something to her. This is his... Do you think they reached the old mining sector? No. The Grand Unifier said Lictor droned into the lower halls. The heretics would have been disintegrated. Scott Halls? Hmm. Yeah, maybe. But if we are lost, at least they can't find us? Where's Scott? What are they doing? Blocking our way forward. So many doors. You do know the way out, right? I do now. There's Gubbins. You named it Gubbins? Yup. Watch this. He's gonna take us to the comm center. There. That's our exit. Okay. We got this. Idiots don't see us yet. Oh, no, dude, dude. The faster we get out, the faster we say things. You mean the faster we find the Milano? We're not leaving her. Just follow Gubbins. He's showing us the way out. Thanks. Look what I like the kid. Of course. He's one of us now. Jeez. Put him through. This won't hurt. But let's finish these guys. The goggles will get us through here. Many 
Torture chamber? They look peaceful. Death can be very peaceful. It's like they're getting That's their lives bro. sucked out. Or their faith. It's like they ain't worth nothing. I've had enough of this nightmare. Tell me we're close to your comm center. Gubbin sent us this he way. He sent us to a dead end. It wasn't a dead end for him. Actually. <gasps> Let's just hope Drax's shortcut leads us in the same direction. Yes, the shortcut. Uh, what should we do with Tom Brady? Nikki's running out of time. So are we. We were never meant to leave this ship. What if we are trapped in our penance? Want me to pinch you? What if we are still inside the dog's mind prison? <sighs> no, you're one mind flark behind. If we were trapped, we'd be stuck in the Nikki thing, not the Cosmo thing. Yeah. Yeah! This is definitely it! A comm center! Finally! Rocket, do your magic. Yeah, yeah. Just let me do it. Must be the calm relay. Or take it off this heap. So, uh, how long is this gonna take? I'm gonna need your help. Sure. All right. Just stand right here. Okay. okay. Perfect.
Why are we pretending we did not witness what we witnessed in the ceremonial chamber? Because the promise is an insidious lie. Well, how can you be certain? Because I wanted to believe it, but I knew when I woke up it... <sighs> we'll all be gone. What did you see? I... am Groot. I saw my mom. In life. But there was something else there too. Yeah, exactly. Whatever it is, it's using the girl. Probably fed her alive her own. About Corral. I know she's the market Scott. Oh. What? That was completely intentional. The Milano's on her way. Oh. Thanks, bud. All right. Let's split, before the Faith Brigade realizes what we did. Where's the Milano supposed to dock? <laughs> it's cute they use the word dock. She doesn't have hangar clearance, so we're gonna have to get creative. Okay, just don't go overboard. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found a rendezvous spot near mm -hmm. the hall. Okay. Peter, there's a workbench we can use. Do it fast if you're gonna. That drone's still hunting us. Oh, no. Dweeb, lead, stupid lead, faith lead, tech lead. door ain't powered. So how do we charge it? Gotta find something compatible with that power port. Maybe I can just zap it? Runs on faith. Unless your guns can squeeze out some faith juice, we're screwed. <sighs> Alright, let's look around. Maybe mm -hmm. we can find something. Got a lazy death bot here. This battery might still have some juice. Worth a mm -hmm. try. Okay. You just keep whoa, whoa! Oh. Not cool. Do you know what you're doing? Sure. Battery in the battery slot, right? Will this work? One way to Did find you know? out. Hook it up. Looks like it worked. Somebody want to fetch the destroyer? Drax. You coming, man? Drax? Hello? What's wrong with him now? Hey, Drax. What's wrong? It has occurred to me that this may be nothing more than a lingering dream. It's not, I promise. But we need to go. Very well. Kind of scary. I've never heard any ship make that noise. Not even Jatari. Is that singing? More like distant chanting. I Whatever think it singing. is. That's a lot of people. We have to go this way. We need to keep pushing forward. Guys, whatever's up there, I just want you to know that there's nobody I'd rather have oh, by my. Is now really the best time for a <laughs> We're about to die speech. Block. Whatever that is, it's really close. This is Flark. There must be millions of them. At least. Yeah, and how are we supposed to help? We need to worry about getting our own tails off this death trap. So Survive. Then we make sure Cosmo knows everything about this nightmare. He'll know what to do. The church comes for us! Flark! Think we can hijack that skiff? Probably. It'll be an ugly hack. Safety's off, people! I'm surprised your gun even has safety! Hope the rest of you are as ready for this as I am! 
your clothes, Rocket! We're really exposed out here! We'll be fine! Just don't get shot! Or let us get shot! Or let the ship get shot! Oops. And what's that? Con jobs, smuggling, and heists. If the church keeps growing, we would have run into them eventually. Yeah. The difference between running into them and running through their ship. Okay, let's see what we can do with this scut. Come on. Come on. You sure you can? Whoa! If just one small faith battery can power one of their robots, imagine the power they harness here. And they're conquering planets now. Even this is small scale. Did you hear that? Hear what? There was... Whoa! Okay, they're just bouncing off the shield. That's what does it. It works. What the scut? Shields down! Blast them! Keep your heads down! I got this! Mm -hmm. Get the flock off of my platform! Yeah! King of the hill, suckers! What is all this? Okay guys, no, I'm gonna end it right here and then I'll continue it after, so yeah, I hope you guys join me like the next time, let me see this one guys. Alright guys, I'll uh, see you guys next time, if you did like it, you can, if you did enjoy it, you can like it, if you didn't, you can just like it, but anyways, uh, have a great day guys and uh, have a great day guys and uh, yeah, peace.